Athena, why don't you give us a tour of the food? You want to show us what we have for food? Here comes Chester. Reichenberger in third. Blauen and Holtz battle for fourth. Gregorich and Meyer offer out back. Got a hole behind him if you need it here. Holtz closing here. High hole, no hole. Still down there, you see him. Right hand line across the gear. Right hand line across the gear. Two here. 
51 from Stevens Point at Kalahari Resorts and Conventions with the law office. Sponsor 51. How about it for Kevin Bird? Driving away, a little bit more on the rumble than you can. 
Wide out back, 
So just a small recap of what's coming up for us race schedule wise and also from the Dells race. Um, we did get P10. That was our first uh, P10 of the year. So top 10 was cool. Um, like I said earlier, the fundamentally the truck wasn't there. I'm pretty sure I found what it was. Um, felt like I was binding up on something. So um, we'll find out in Jefferson if I got that fixed. But I'm hoping I, I found the culprit and have it fixed and have a better idea of, uh, of what happened there. So... Um, this summer with this truck has been a lot of um, learning curves. Um, I've never worked this hard on at something before, and the mistakes I've been making has taught me for the future. At least that's one way to look at it. So um, I'm I'm proud of I'm proud of our team. I'm proud of what we've done this year. Um, I get down on myself pretty easy. Uh, I've got a couple comments about that of how I'm always saying sorry. Um, and I, and I shouldn't be doing that, but, uh, I just, I just absolutely have the passion for this sport. I have the passion to be out in the garage working on this. I have the passion to do well. So when we don't do well, I take it very personally because I put a lot of time into it and that time is, is on me. So I want to do well for my team and my sponsors. And, um, the first top 10 was really, really nice. I feel like we're moving up every week. So, uh, we had our personal best at Madison and then we topped it off with our personal best at the Dells. So now we go to Jefferson. Uh, this video should be on Monday, I'm hoping. Um, so we'll go to Jefferson Friday. Uh, Caleb races Marshfield Saturday. Then after that, we have Oktoberfest where Caleb will race three days. I will race two days with the truck. And then after the Oktoberfest, we go to our last race of the year for the trucks. And that will be the following race at the Dells. So um, this summer has flown by unbelievably quick it's hard to believe that it's almost october already so um i gotta give a big thank you to everybody that helps us um without everybody's support help there's no way i could do this um i'm extremely blessed to have not only the sponsors backing me that i have um, backing me but the friend friends i have in my crew um i don't think i say it enough to them how much i appreciate their time and effort um, so if you guys are watching this, thank you very much for all your time, effort, hard work, support, everything. Um, I get pretty wrapped up in a lot of other things and I know I should probably say it more and I don't get to, uh, that's so from bottom of my heart, thank you each and everybody that comes and helps weekly on this thing. Um, could not do it without you guys. Uh, Kale and Lauren again are killing it with all the footage they take. Um, you know, they, they make the vlogs look really, really nice. And without their multiple camera views, this wouldn't be the product that it is. So thank you guys for your filming and always watching. Um, we had a lot of friends and family that came um, to the Dells race. It was awesome to see everybody. It was really cool to see all the um, the cheering and, and everything like that. Another fly in the shop. Imagine that. Um, so thank you guys for coming to the track. Um, it's, it's really neat to have a support system like I do. I have, um, two younger kids, Marvin 
and Brooks. Um, Brooks on his uh, kindergarten card said that his favorite race car driver was me. And those are some pretty tall shoes to fill considering Jake Chopik's his dad and his grandfather is Jay Chopik. Um, so I don't, I don't take that lightly. I think it's pretty cool because I was him once. I had my idols to look up to. Um, same with Marvin. Marvin got to use our radio and, and listen to our chatter. So that was cool to kind of have Marvin get the full race day experience. So um, thank you to you two uh, guys for always being the biggest fans that we have. It's really neat. Um, Caleb um, and the Kalahari, thank you guys for all of the support this year. Um, could not do it without you guys at all. Um, I'm truly a blessed person to be doing this sport. And um, just the passion and love for it. So uh, another big shout out to my dad for helping. He's always here at the shop with me. We're going over numbers constantly. So um, it's nice to, to run things by each other. And um, I know I'm forgetting something. I know I'm forgetting someone, but we got two more races to... To make sure we get the right, everybody thinks, but if if you've helped, if you've supported, if you've reached out, if you've messaged, if you watch the vlogs, um, thank you so much for watching them. Um, yesterday I was at my cousin's wedding. Uh, congratulations to Dan and Allison. You guys uh, deserve a good future together. I'm, I'm glad it's working out, and that's where I was really, really blessed to be there at the wedding. Um Dan watches the vlogs religiously, so that's kind of neat that my cousins watch that. Uh, thank you guys for watching those. So, And also thank you everybody who watches these. Um, it's still really neat to have people come up and say they watch them. Um, so with that being said, this is long-winded. I apologize for being so long-winded on this, but it takes a lot of people to make this thing get on the track. And uh, very lucky to be the guy behind the wheel of it. So... Uh, again, we'll be at Jefferson on Friday, uh, Marshfield Saturday. We'll have a vlog for each, and then we'll be rearing up for my favorite event of the year, hands down. If I had to pick one thing to go to a year, it would definitely be Oktoberfest and lacrosse. So um, we'll keep you guys updated on the social pages and the YouTube page. And uh, subscribe if you haven't. Share this page with someone you think that might like it. And uh, we'll see you at the next race.